where are we? I'm very confused. Beyond the Dwarven Dark. Hmm. Okay. What's going on? Let's see. Where did I get this greater training knife? Oh. Hold on. <sighs> it's so dramatic and so awesome. All at the same time. Save. Okay. <laughs> Alright, now where are we? Where did I get this greater training knife? It can break. Hmm. Some items can be right clicked. Some heads can secretly be machines. Oh my goodness. What's this? Start the game? Oh my gosh. Prologue. My best friend. Oh. Your game mode has been updated to adventure mode. In the peaceful mining village of Barry Burry lives Jimmy. Barry Burry lives Jimmy, a young dwarf. His dad is the local firework craftsman, his mom, a dwarven warrior who has been away for years at the front of a war that never seems to end. Even so, come back, even so the war seems far away up here in the mountains, and Jimmy is desperate to leave the village and have adventures of his own, but in the meantime, all he can do is talk to his friend Dougal? Dougal? Let's call him Dougie. Talk to his friend Dougie. <clears throat> One of the town guards, listening to Dougie's war stories and tales of outside the walls and hoping for a bit of excitement in his life one day. <clears throat> oh. Hmm. I lost my training knife. It's kind of unfair. Jimmy! Jimmy! Oh. Are you not up yet, son? It's time for breakfast. Uh, yes, I am. Oh. Apple. Take some of this. Here be dragons by Lillian Brockhurst. Oh, is it like a book? You can only sleep at night. Okay. Oh. There you Hi, Jacob. are. Eat some bread. You need to get your chores done. Eat some bread. Now, lad, here's your work for this morning. I need you to go into town for a few things. First, you need to pick up your hoe from the blacksmith. It should be fixed by now. Then go to the cobbler. My new boots should be ready. Then check in at the post office and see if there's a letter from your mom. And on the way home, get us some hot pies from the baker for our lunch. Off you go, Jimmy. That's the spirit. Oh, I can, I can acknowledge. There's like beer. things I can click. What are the folks under? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I wonder what it looks. That's the spirit. Why can I not? No, can't click on that one. All right, hold on. We'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. You guys noticed no time go by, but I turned up some sounds. Uh, hopefully, it's a little bit better. So we'll take one more break. Um, no. We'll probably end up taking one more break. I want to read her. Here be dragons. Can I read this? Oh, so far, you've learned of Crassel, the ice dragon, Shenderman, who spits acid, Lorunga, the fire dragon, and Avarella, who controls the storm of nature herself. But one is greater than all these, the Black Lord Goldstat. Goldstat is a creature of legend. It is said that none who see him survive to tell of it. None who see him survive... Oh, none who see him, comma, survived to tell of it. He is said to be of great size and immeasurable strength. Dangerous even to his own kind, he has killed and absorbed the powers of many other dragons, and has the ability of all others we have studied. Hmm. No more is known of him or what realm he resides in. Okay, cool. Let's put that away. I have five gold nugget and an apple. I thought he said something about bread. No? I forgot what I was doing. Uh, I need to get something from the cobbler, hoe from the blacksmith, 
And then go to the cobbler for boots. Okay. Hey, what about Dougie? So this is an adventure map. Good morning, Jimmy. Working hard, I see. Greet. Greet. All quiet on the wall today, lad. Oh. Uh, I've been here for a long, long time. You, I wish there was someone that spoke for Jimmy. I was there when Bellows fell. I should tell you about it one day. Bellows fell. Hmm. Well, we're at war. Never been outside. Safe the walls. here within these walls, but outside, you can't be sure, lad. You ready to learn anything? Have a look at the view. Come on, Daggy. <laughs> and risk my job, Jimmy. Don't you worry about outside the wall. Worry about getting your jobs done. Life's much better here in the village. Oh, come on, Dougie. Okay, fine. What about my mother? Your mother's a brave soldier. It was an honor to fight beside her. I know you haven't heard from her in a long time, but I'm sure she's fine. Well, I certainly hope she is. Hmm, I hope so, too. All right, bye, Dougie. Can I say bye? Oh, okay, I can. All right, bye, Dougie. Okay, I did one more setup change. That's a duck. So things should be a little bit more normal. I guess I shouldn't walk. Lumberjack, I love working outdoors. Fresh air and the smell of nature. Oh, there's music. Where are you, Dwarven Guard? Hey, Dwarven Citizen. <clears throat> do, do, do. Rosa. Is she in here? He's like behind here. Oh. There's a chest. Get some stuff. I've got some food, a pick. Let's keep these. I don't know what the fireworks are for, but you know, let's keep them nearby. It's an adventure map, you gotta explore things, right? So that ended abruptly. And I presume not starved to death. Rosa must not be this way. She must be like this way, but not this way. Rosa, lunchtime special. Oh, Rosa's like the cook. Good morning, Jimmy. Give me some bread. That bread smells fantastic. Dad wants pumpkin pie. What? I asked for bread and he gave me pie. <clears throat> oh yeah, was I supposed to be getting something from Rosa? Go to the door. Now, uh, first you need to pick up a hoe. Go to the cobbler. You ready? Then check in at the post office and on the way home, hot pies. Okay, we got hot pies from Rosa. I wanted bread. Hold on. I feel like before we venture too far into town. Who are you? Farmer. It's over here. What do we got? These crops sure don't want to grow. No, they don't, Jimmy. Oh, goodness. Oh, I guess you can grow crops. Uh, let's leave that stuff in here. Oh, no. Whoops. <clears throat> I guess in case you need bread, you can craft bread, I assume. It is... Oh, that is Minecraft after all. Naughty little dwarves. What are you guys doing? What are you doing? What are you three doing? Nothing? Okay. Hey, Jimmy. They steal something from me? No. What's in here? At a well? That's like a well. Oh, can I ride a horse? No? Okay, it should be known. Bear. Bear is perfectly fine. Who's a good boy? Who's a good boy? Are you mine? I'm like an empty. No? Pig. Pig doesn't have a name. Alright, there's Dougie. This is where we began. No, that's where we began. 
Who's in there? I guess I can't go in there. All right. What's over here? Oh, I thought this was the gate. Oh, this is the gate. Baby dwarf. Oh, this is the lumberjack that said something to me two, two minutes ago. Oh, it's a baby. Can I not talk to the baby? Just... Can I not get that? No. Adventure mode. What did that do? Oh, that just raises those. <laughs> Because, you know, it is Minecraft after all. Anything else up here? No. Alright, so what is D what is the Dwarven Dark? What is this all about? So this is based on a game by Robert Moran um, called Dwarves vs. Zombies. And it's sort of set in that world. Dwarves vs. Zombies is a tower defense game um, where basically you play a bunch of dwarves and you're defending the tower. This guy came to town yesterday to bring news for the mayor. He seems not to be in any hurry. Who are you? Can I talk to you? No. I can't seem to get there, but there's a crowd. Anyway, Doors vs. Zombies is a tower defense game where you are a bunch of doors and you're defending your castle. The horde is pushing in. Even Ansem from the far north is under siege now. Oh. That's cool. Time waits for no man. Buy a new clock today, Deme. You people need to ration your food more. You can't live your life carefree like that. We're at war. Oh. He's all like talkative and stuff. I'm trying to explain what Dwarves vs. Zombies is. Again, it's a tower defense game. You defend your castle. Um, or your keep from the ruthless onslaught of zombies and other various monsters. Hey, Timmy. Selling time. I can get a cluck. Uh, I don't know yet. I'm ready for a clock. I've only got five gold. I'm gonna starve to the post office. Okay. Postmaster. Hello. Where did I put that last parcel? Parcel. Parcel's over there behind you. Oh, there it is indeed. Thank you, lad. No mail for you, and you're bad today, though. Maybe tomorrow. Come on. There's mail. No. No? Okay. That's the end of that exchange. Behind you, man. You can interact with these things, supposedly. Or I can just, you know, barge into the post office. So this is set in the DVZ universe, in the DVZ, uh, which is Doors vs. Zombies universe. So I presume that eventually we're going to be defending this castle, or we're going to be finding a keep, this is our town, and we're going to be defending it. Wait, I was supposed to get the mail. I need a cobbler, blacksmith. Did I miss the blacksmith? Alright, so we did the post office thing. Oh, more food. Another kitchen knife. Never have enough food. Paper. I don't know what that's gonna be for, but I'll take it. The one I already opened. Yes. Okay. Oh, here's a town. Things. Fish salesman. He sells fish stall. Urban citizen. So you can. Fresh fish. You catch them, we buy them. I can get a gem. Doll owner. Fresh fish. Newspaper vendor. Give me that. I want some news. Why can I not get news? Newspaper. Keep of Erebor Falls after just one night. Hundreds missing. Oh, jeez. I have a feeling the Keep of Erebor is where our ultimate, you know, journey is going to take us. Orvin guard. Ah, oh, here we go. The blacks. No, that's a miner. You're not the blacksmith. All the other dwarven mining settlements are extracting gold. Berry, berry. I sure hope Hazel keeps out of the mines. This place is nasty these days. Hazel. Hazel. Where do you think you're going, Jimmy? Mines are off limits for kids. Let me through, Hazel. 
Yeah, I'm no kid anymore. You keep telling yourself that, Jimmy. It's true. I'm not a kid. All right, we're looking for the blacksmith and the cobbler. Alrighty. Frida's flirty footwear. Oh. Frida, and then I said to her, well, that's what you get for using shoddy materials. And then she said, oh, boots. I, I just want boots. Good morning, Dad said that his new boots would be ready today. This must be the cobbler. That's right, here they are. Thank you, Frida. Hey, every day, I cannot read that fast. Ha, every day is a good. Whoa, I think Dad just blew up the house again. Better go check it back and check on him. Uh, and I should put my boots on. Boots, boots, boots. Uh, Jerry's famous slaughterhouse. Hey, Jerry. You buy land, you buy stones, you buy meat, you buy bones. Okay, so you get the butcher. I need a blacksmith though, Jerry. Hank smashing the flora. <laughs> oh, you can sell mushrooms for gold. Okay, so you could like farm stuff. Fitton's puppet show. Can I sit? No. I just keep like hopping over things. All right, uh, master blacksmith here. Give me a master blacksmith. Hey, yo, I need things. Yo, master blacksmith. Oh, here we go. I assume that the actual people have you no know, names. Thomas has your hoe. Thomas. Thomas. Give me Jimmy's trusty you giving me buy it? I gotta buy it from you. Alright, whatever. Damn it, Thomas. 